Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Miss J00. Today I'm coming on doing a VR for Lori over at PD Pie Designs. She's having a birthday challenge and it's going on till November 21st. And you just have to, um, she said you could create anything, literally anything at all. She loves everything. So, um, and then you could do it in any style too. So um, that's what I did. And when you do, a, you have to do a VR if you're able, and then you just use this hashtag right there. Um, yeah, so um, I know that she loves scary stuff, so that's what I focused on. I tried to do it before Halloween, but I'm such a slow crafter, you guys. <laughs> I get, um, my attention span is like not very good, so I get distracted really easy. Um, but anyway, I got it in before the date. <laughs> so, and I, when you're looking at this video, I'll, um, it'll probably be when she already has it. So, but I just thought I'd do a video. So, this is the first thing I made her. It's a folio. Um, just untie it. Hope you don't get irritated by this ribbon. <laughs> I don't know. I just think it looks nice. Laced up. There you go. So then this opens up like this. And then you open it like this. And it has all of this waterfall. And she could put pictures or journaling here. And then each waterfall has a card. And they have like little sayings and pictures. So this one says Dark Night. Night Owl with the floral collection with the watch. And see how they all have different pictures or different sayings. Floral, majestic. Butterfly with nocturnal roses with ephemera. Let's see this one. Oh, just where she could uh, write something down if she wants. Treasures. And see, uh, they all have our blank on the back where she could add a picture or whatever she wants. I put all these little pockets in the back of each one. Then another picture. Okay. All right. And then she can, if she wants to, can put, you know, picture here or journal here if she wanted to. Um, and then I had these side pockets, and I just put little tags in there. An owl, some tickets, some random stuff. I was going to um, package this up, and then I was like, oh, let me do a video. And then I really remembered I never did a VR. So then she likes all this scary stuff. I do too, so I had no problem creating this. <laughs> I wish we could craft with this kind of stuff all year round. Okay, and then that closes up. And then on the back, I put this closure with the ribbon. You just untie it. Now I use these are just uh, paper um, like buttons, and then I use my little gem uh, brads. So it's just a brad, and for the closure, that turned out pretty. And then this is on the inside, and I just did a skull tag with some um, some lace that I had. It's like the end of a lace that you usually throw away, but I save it and put a little brad on there with a button and a little another tag. And then I did this one with lace and stapled it with one of the tickets uh, underneath this, the skulls. And some more tickets, just some more tags, some florals, and then this house, which she can put pictures or whatever she wants on the back. And this is the back. And she can put stuff here if she wants to on here. And then this is a pocket. I'll fix 
it. I'll fix it later. Okay, so that's her folio that I made her. Um, and then I made her this. I got these little, like, little treasure chests off of Timu. They're only like a dollar, maybe a dollar twenty each. And they had silver, gold, bronze. Um, so I thought I'd make her a little treasure chest. And it opens up and you just fill it with goodies. So then I just put some little resin roses with um, half, black, half back pearls and some trims that I used and some more um, of these kind of uh, gems. Just some little goodies. Oh, and then I got some floral lace back there. And I just glued a this is, used to be an earring, and I took it apart and put it on there. And then some of that material that I used on my boo bag. And then uh, one of those little spiders from Timu, I believe. Actually, I think a friend gifted me, a uh, sweet crafty friend gifted me a whole bunch of these. So I used one on that. And then I made her, I altered one of these um, Dollar Tree mirrors. Had a black one and put all kind of stuff on here. <laughs> um, I use that material. Well, first I put the, you probably can't see it, but there's floral, like my flower trim down below. So it's like laying on a bed of uh, roses. <laughs> and then I put this um, material on the back and it's fraying all on the ends, which I like. And then I put black roses. And then I, I had all black at first and I even put the black leaves um, and then these little flowers, just different flowers. Um, but then I was like, it needs a little pop of color. So then I started putting the little tiny red flowers. Um, and then this is one of the skeletons from, gosh, I think Dollar Tree. I'm not sure. Dollar Tree or Walmart. You know, you get the, um, it's like a banner of them. I just took them apart. And then this is a, one of the uh, spiders that I had in my stash. Um, I think those are from Walmart. And then this one, I, I needed a smaller spider, so I just cut one out in paper, and then I put the flocking on it to make it a little glittery, and I had him over there. Yeah, so it's my altered mirror. hope I'm zoomed out enough, yeah. So then on the other side, I was just going to leave it a mirror, but then I got one of these pictures. A friend gave me the idea of like, putting one of these pictures where they you turn it, and then it turns into a ghost or... Uh, I don't know if you would call her a ghost. Looks like a vampire. She's got vampire teeth. So she's a creature. <laughs> so I thought she'd get a kick out of that. So that was the other thing I made. And then I made her these cards. Let me take them out of the bag. I'm having a lot of fun uh, with the digitals. So first I had made this card. And I know it's probably gloomy for most, but... Lori likes stuff like this, so <laughs> I thought she'd get a kick out of it. Um, so at first I had put this together, and then I was like, it's just missing something. So I was trying to find like a clown or something peeking around the corner. Um, so there's nothing inside. So I sent her that since I didn't use it. But then I added uh, this little scary dude. <laughs> and oh, I got my note in there, but I want you to see the sentiment. Need help cutting your cake? I just wrote that because I thought it was kind of cool that um, he's there. He's there to help her cut her cake. <laughs> so anyway, yeah, that's what I made for Lori. Um, you still have a lot of time, even though I'm a little behind. I wanted to get this before Halloween, but it just wasn't happening. <laughs> um, I don't even know if I can get everything in here in the frame. Huh? So yeah, these are what I'm going to be sending her. And like I said, she'll have already received this when I lit this video up. So you got plenty of time. You have till November 21st. That's when she'll uh, end the the uh, challenge. And I think she'll have a drawing after that. I don't remember. Um, I think that's her official birthday too. So um, and she has great prizes. I think the first one's $100 and the second is 50 and the third... I'm not sure if the th third was 25 or another 50. I can't remember. You'll have to go to her video. I'll link her video on my description um, so you can get all the details because 
I'm probably missing something. But anyway, hope everybody's having a great day, and I'll talk to you later. All right, bye-bye.